Hello, today I would like to show you one of my fun little older programs called Sim Immune Response. It's an educational simulation of the human immune response using some kind of C++ library. And you can uh, download it from the GitHub, Rich Bilderbeek, that's my username, slash Sim Immune Response. And then you can click on download the Windows executable and you can download it. Then, if you have it, it's in my downloads folder, then uh, for example I use Linux, so I need to use Wine, Sim, Immune Response, and that will also work fine. So now the program is started, and here we can see Sim Immune Response working. You see on my desktop there are two games I've installed, and uh, here it says what I need to do. If I would create macrophages, so produce one, macrophages are producing the bone marrow, need to move them to the bloodstream, need to ingest the virus. What do I need to do now? Macrophage, send it to the lymph node, I'm sent to the lymph node. And now we must create a T helper cell. And so all the steps are here, this is the legend. I think that the T cell must connect to the macrophage. Let's do that. So now it's making. Hey, there's no B cell. Ah! Produce a B cell to start the humoral response. It needs to be sent to the lymph node as well. Activate by the cytokines, I would assume. And now it's creating antibodies. So, what I just did, I showed you how the simulation worked. It's a fairly easy, uh, it's self-explanatory. I wanted to test with some students, like a group that used this tool and one that didn't. The group that did use this tool did score significantly better, but I don't know to what extent. Right? Well, in the game, yeah, you can die. Uh, let's take a look at the about screen, all right? It's a typical about screen. Uh, you can die, so the, the students need to be, uh, need to not rush, you saw how I uh, easily played through it. Hey, because these viruses, they get into these cells and these cells then die and if all cells are dead, uh, you, uh, you, you, you're game over because this is the tissue. <laughs> and I know that some students, they think that you can acquire immunity by just killing all the viruses with macrophages. Uh, that won't help at all because these new viruses will be produced constantly. And the game will end when all these cells are gone, or either when their antibodies are produced and that the uh, organism has acquired immunity. Alright, so that was uh, not only an introduction, but also a walkthrough to, to, um, through this game. Uh, I did this, I used this in a Dutch class, so there's also some uh, Dutch lesson material uh, that you can use, and this is a PDF. Uh, but there's also uh, an open document text file, and there's also a, like a, like a, a word document. Uh, all right, so that's all I wanted to say about Sim Immune Response. I'm happy I could find it back again in the big code I have, and I wish you a very good day. Bye.